Ear infections are a common health concern especially among infants and young children. The ear consists of three main parts the outer ear, middle ear and inner ear. Infections often occur in the middle ear known as a titus media. Babies are particularly susceptible to ear infections due to their developing immune systems. Babies may express discomfort or pain by pulling or tugging at their ears. They might also be more irritable than usual. A baby with an ear infection may develop a fever. Monitoring the baby's temperature can help to identify if an infection is present. Babies with ear infections often become more irritable, fussier and may have difficulty in sleeping. Changes in behavior can be a key indicator. Babies may show a decrease in appetite due to the discomfort associated with swallowing, as the infection can affect the throat as well. Persistent crying especially when lying down, which can be a sign of ear pain. Babies may cry more than usual without an obvious reason. Since ear infections involve the middle ear, there may be temporary hearing loss or difficulty responding to sounds. In some cases ear infections can affect the baby's balance, which leading to clumsiness or difficulty maintaining an upright position. Babies may instinctively tug or rub their ears in an attempt to alleviate the discomfort caused by the infection. There are several steps you can take to reduce your child's risk of developing ear infections. The best way to protect your child against cold and flu is to keep your hands clean. Wash your hands with soap and water for 20 seconds each time. Babies who are up to date on their vaccines get fewer ear infections than the unvaccinated children's. Breast milk contains antibodies that may help to reduce the risk of ear infections. Whether you feed milk make sure your child sits up during feedings. This will prevent fluid from flowing into the middle ear. It's important to note that these symptoms can vary, and not all babies will exhibit the same signs. If you suspect your baby has an ear infection, it is advisable to seek medical attention. A healthcare professional can provide an accurate diagnosis and recommend an appropriate course of treatment.